Kristen Scott Thomas was in Rome for the premiere of The Woman in the Fifth about American writer Tom, played by Ethan Hawkes, who goes to Paris to try to win back his wife and daughter. The, the story of a man in deep, deep, deep trouble, and this woman is very, is she real, is she unreal? Is she, she represents all these different things for this, this writer who is really at the end of his tether, you know, has all these catastrophes hanging, uh, happening to him all the time. This woman could be his savior, but we don't know. <laughs> Dear Chloe, these last few years have been so hard on our family, but I'm here now. I've relocated to Paris. Chloe? What I need is to be close to my daughter. To ma manque petit sandwich. Chloe? I'm a novelist. What sort of novels do you write? I only wrote one. It was good. Charlotte Rampling was also at the Rome Film Festival to present her movie, The Eye of the Storm, in which she plays a dying woman. My mother believes that being of a certain class entitles you to die whenever you damn well please. Don't we wish? A knight and a princess returning to the foreign shores of their homeland. It was pissing down the last time I was in Sydney. How could they not disappoint? Dorothy! Oh! Basil! Oh! <laughs> mother, why are you so late? Put down to your hair. 65-year-old Rampling says it was an experience playing a woman 15 years her senior. How's yours? <laughs> if you allow yourself that luxury to be old, to be maybe ugly, to be more unattractive, to be less desirable, to be, be even less, yeah, all that. If you allow yourself as an actor to be that certain times, you'll find that the rewards are extraordinary. You think I don't know why you've flown all across the earth? Based on the novel of the same name by Nobel Prize winner Patrick White, The Eye of the Storm follows the last days of the vicious yet hilarious Elizabeth Hunter. The festival runs until the end of the week and includes 15 in-competition films. Two great disappointments.